I have a tray of seeds here that didn't sprout for some reason and as you see the others have already begun and I planted the ones in the big tray after I planted the ones in this little tray like a day later I believe and I planted two trays in these small trays the same day and none of them came out they were peas so what I decided to do was to check the viability of the seeds because um, they were a couple of years old and according to the data on the package they should still be good but I'm wondering about the viability of the seeds so I'll show you what we did or what I did to check the viability okay so what I have here is a seed sprouter and I usually use it as the name says to sprout seeds that we eat but I also use it sometimes to go ahead and germinate some seeds so I can check the viability of them so I took the peas and I spread them across the bottom in the sprouter and I can already tell that some of them are not going to be good just by the way that they plumped or didn't plump so to speak and we'll see it'll take a couple of days we'll see what comes of them okay I'll keep you posted okay so this is what they look like after three days, the peas, you see they're nice, plumped, and swollen. And you know what? I am actually surprised at how many of them did germinate, but it was more than I thought would, but definitely it's time to get new seeds. Um, so, well, actually I have new seeds, but this was, I was trying to use up the last of these older seeds. So, um, again, check the viability of your seeds and make sure you have good seeds on hand so I would guess from the looks of it about a third maybe a little bit more of these are good maybe even up to half but I don't think quite that many if uh here let's see if we'll look in the top there Whoops. so if you see yeah probably about a third no uh, probably about a half of them actually sprouted little tails to plant so um, it could just be the medium wasn't that great but um, I think it's just time to get new seeds um, I used the same organic medium on the other seeds that I planted and they all did fine so I'm thinking um, time to use newer seeds we'll restock from last year's okay here's five days after we started and as you see they got some nice tails on them and you'll see that many in here didn't sprout so we ended up getting about probably better than I thought originally thought we were going to get on the sprouting but um, not one of them see like this one didn't this one didn't do anything so there's several of them in there like that so we probably did end up getting a over half that actually sprouted at least a third of them did not though and I've already picked some of those out um, and you'll see there's a group right in here that didn't but anyway so just a good way to check your seed viability to know when you need new seeds and these are doing really nice I've got some and I just transplanted some of them now so all right just a little way to check to see if your seeds are viable Okay, so here we are. This is what the peas that we sprouted look like. They're in varying stages. So, not too bad, not too bad. Uh, those back there are my green beans. The ones in the front and in the front row here are the peas that we sprouted so they took root and it's looking pretty good these are especially looking good these got a little leggy but that's okay they got a lot of roots once I get them in the ground hopefully tomorrow we're supposed to get our last freeze tonight for a while so I uh, hopefully we'll get these in the ground then